Hood Chip off the old block toys. This is Jeff here, and I've got an exciting city update. Now, this is going to be a long video for me. For you, it's just going to all run together, but for me, this is going to take several days. Now, I know I'm due for a Avengers Tower update. However, it is 41 degrees outside, which means it's 53 in the shop, which means this is one of the few days that it's even comfortable to work out here. So, I'm just going to take this opportunity to do this now. I will get to the Avengers Tower. But let's start off with talking about all the things that need to happen. I am kind of in a really bad spot with all of this. I've got so many irons in the fire with this set, I gotta get moving on it. Now, the population of this city right now, as it stands, is seven. By the end of the video, that might change. But let's go ahead and let's review the different things that need to happen. So first things first, this table is a complete mess. I've just got so many different things going on because of different windmill versions, all that. So the first thing I need to do is have you hit the like button and subscribe if you feel like I've earned your subscription. But what I need to do, not what you need to do, is I need to clean this off. Okay, so this is now cleaned off and you always need a clean slate, slate to start. Now, I do have a few pieces over here in the front, but that's not gonna bother it. But what is gonna bother it is since I decided to go with the Vestas windmill, I don't have enough room. If I put it right here, they're gonna be too close. So what do I need to do? Well, okay, on the count of three, we're gonna push this back a whole entire plate, 10 inches. And we're gonna basically add here so we have enough room to put one of these windmills where this doesn't exist right now. So, and Gertie, wants, she wants to help. She's such a great helper. Okay, on the count of three, let's do this. One, two, and three. Oh, this is so heavy. Oh, oh, there we go. All right. Oh, man. Now I'm left with this gap. Let's see what we can do about that. So now I've run into another problem. I pushed this back, filled this in as much as I could. I have plenty of the 4x4 four four plates, but I don't have enough of the brick. Well, no fear. I went inside over dinner. And I stopped off on BrickLink, and I have purchased all the bricks I need to fill this in. But they just won't be here in time for the video. So maybe that's next week's or the week after's video. Now, next, I need to focus on something else. So this is part of the old plan right here. And so is this right here. And so are these right here. So I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to tear this up as much as I need to and fill this in, tear it up, whatever I need to do here, as well as tear that all out. And I'll be back when I'm done with that. So all this has been torn up. This had the axles and the Technic one by two blue bricks to conceal those axles. There is a little bit left right here, but here's the deal. I really can't tear this out yet because unfortunately this nice, beautiful rock cropping that I built has got to go. Um, and I don't really mean got to go. I mean, it has to be torn up so I could take all the gears and the motors and stuff that's inside of here out and then rebuild it. So it's probably not gonna look exactly the same because I'm not gonna remember it all, but that's a video for another week. I have done a lot of work here. And in fact, let's show you some of the other work I did today. So here you have uh, one built windmill or wind turbine. You've got a spot for another, a spot for another, and yet a spot for another. Now, like I said, the other two are gonna have to be on this side of the table, which is not doesn't exist and it's not on camera yet. And no fear, I actually have the windmills for that. And here's the proof. So here they are, one, two, three, four, five, and number six right here. And you have the six wind turbines for the wind turbine farm. If you guys wanna help the channel, please, head over to PayPal and make a donation if you can, or head over to BrickLink. In fact, uh, your guys' BrickLink orders paid for these six wind turbines, so thank you. And if you need parts for your builds, head over to my store, link's in the description. If you don't have money to help the channel, that is totally fine. There are two other ways you can help me out, and that is watch another video right after this one, or you can share this video or any of my other videos on other social media platforms you find yourself on and get the word out there for me. Be my marketing department. That helps me out. I don't have the time, don't have the money, but if you have the time, please do. All right, guys, be good to each other. Stay safe out there and be looking out for our next city update video.